So the famous quote goes like, "Comparison is the thief of all joys." In today's society, a lot of us are suffering from mental illness, depression, anxiety, and a lot of it is being caused through social media. When we look at people's posts of the high life, you know, the flashy cars, the best food, holidays, you know, just classy pictures and other people on the other end looking at the screen and being depressed, envying, jealousy is coming in creeping into our hearts and saying we could have been there. You know, why are they in that situation? Why why can't we be in that situation? Wives are saying, look at other people's wives, they're driving C classes, uh, Mercedes, you know, what not, BMW, Maserati, or they're going on holidays. This is causing problems in the house. And then, you know, men are looking at serial entrepreneurs and scholars and saying, you know, I could have been there. And, you know, it's causing jealousy in the heart, whereas we could have not focused on that and spend that time focusing on our own goals, focusing on our self so that we can better ourselves. Key to that is because this causes severe mental illness and people are not realizing that. The key to that is that we have to be content with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, what He has given us so that we can enjoy whatever Allah has given us to the fullest. What we need to do is not to focus on people's lives. We may have to take some time out from social media and meditate, be closer to Allah. Because what we need to understand is that everything happens with the will of Allah, risk comes from Allah, and Allah loves those people who work hard and stay consistent. And then we taste the fruits through patience. And that is actually a therapy for you, for your mental health. That you balance your life with your work and the meditation being closer to Allah. What we need to do is we need to get um, professional help if, we, if that's what helps us reach our goals uh, when it comes to uh, you know, running a business, being an entrepreneur. Go get professional help, get a mentor, get a sheikh who will help you spiritually and focus on your goals. Don't focus on other people's life Go, go, you can go and get your dream, but focusing on your goals, not other people's goals. Focusing on your own goals, on what you want to do in your life, and being content with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, what Allah has given you.